The Mark Wandell Traffic Safety Act has given Florida cities and counties the power since 2010 to use cameras to catch red light runners by installing cameras at intersections to record license plates and issue civil citations of $158 to the registered owners. It's widely praised by those communities for reducing crashes and saving lives, and most drivers we talk with think it works. I think it, it does make, make, make it safer for us because at the end of the day, a lot of people run the red lights. Because it will be safer, people want what we're doing. That's how I feel. Now a Central Florida lawmaker has filed a bill to repeal the red light camera law in Florida. That would give communities until the middle of 2024 to remove all of this camera equipment. House Bill 6009 to remove the traffic infraction detectors is sponsored by Republican Anthony Sabatini of Lake County. Red light cameras have saved zero lives in Florida. They've helped zero people. A 2018 study by Florida International University concluded the raw figures show little benefit compared to the intersections that did not use automated enforcement. Safety aside, Florida communities are gradually unplugging the cameras. At its peak in 2014, there were 82 red light camera programs, including 18 in Central Florida. They generated $130 million for state and local government. Last year, it was down to 58 state programs, nine local ones, and $106 million. The red light repeal has previously passed the House, but not the Senate. In Orange County, Greg Fox, Washington News.